Now you will learn how to use the take profit and stop loss on Binance futures and on Binance spot. For example, set an automated take profit order when you have turned $10 into $70, $100 into $500, $1000 into $1100 or whatever you choose. First, when you want to start making money on Binance and use the take profit and stop loss orders, you need to have a 100% free account. And I will leave you a link in the description right here below the video where you can get the best welcome bonuses. This is perfect for you if you are planning to do trading because you will specifically get trading bonuses using my link. Once you are inside Binance you are ready to start trading and let's talk about the basics. What does the stake profit and stop loss even mean? It means that you buy or sell after the asset reaches a specific price. For example, if the market price is 105,000 USDT, you can set take profit when the price goes into 150,000 USDT. Or stop loss when the price drops to 90 thousand USDT. However, you shouldn't put round numbers for the reasons that I will explain later for you in the video. So it's much better to put, for example, numbers like this. But let's start going through the take profit and stop loss from the spot trading. You will find Binance Spot here on the trade and spot and then you can start trading. Here the most popular order types are limit order, market order, but then there is a stop limit and stop market. If you want to take profit and stop loss, then use the stop market instead of stop limit. Because with stop limit you might miss the take profit or stop loss if you set the prices too close and the market is moving too fast. Stop market is better because it pretty much guarantees the sell if the price is reached. Let me give you a couple of examples. Let's say that you are trading BTC USDT which is the most popular trading pair on Binance and the price is for example 104.5k. Then you can set up here a stop price so take profit for example 110,000 and then you can choose the amount right here. However, I recommend that you set this a little bit lower than that, for example like this. So then it will be triggered before that round number where most people are setting their take profit orders. Then you can simply click here sell BTC, then you can still verify the details and click here confirm. It goes immediately here into open orders and you can see it right here. Take profit market exactly as wanted. Now let's set up also stop loss price. For example if the BTC would drop so now we could say 90 K, but again we don't want to use the round numbers so we put 90k and 50 and then you put the amount right here and then you click here sell BTC you can verify the details and confirm and now we have a stop loss market order and take profit and you can also set up multiple take profit and stop loss orders let me show another example I've changed the number here I put the amount right here I click sell BTC I confirm now I have two stop loss orders and one take profit. Let's put another take profit order just for the example's sake. Now I have two take profit and two stop loss orders. But you notice here one thing. Binance is locking these funds into these orders. You can see the available BTC balance goes down all the time because these are locking my BTC into these orders. So in that sense if you want to do spot trading and you want to use take profit then and stop losses, buy bit spot trading is better because it has much more flexibility. You can use not only the take profit and stop loss, but also the conditional and then it doesn't lock funds in the same way as the Binance locks your funds. For more flexible and perhaps easier spot trading you probably want to use Bybit spot. Our subscribers also get massive welcome bonuses for Bybit up to $30,000 in welcome rewards. I will also leave your link in the description 
for Bybit as well so you can get started and do spot trading more easily and more flexibly than on Binance. Now let me show you how to cancel. You can cancel these orders one by one by clicking here or you can simply click here cancel all and then it will cancel all of these orders right here. Now if you want to use one a single order that would act both as take profit and stop loss you might want to use this OCO order so one cancels the other and here you can put the take profit and then also the stop loss at the same time let me just quickly give you an example right here now i'm putting round numbers because it's just an example i scroll this one right here 1000 usdt order i click here sell and you can see it goes right here so now if either one is triggered so that cancels the other that's why it's called oco one cancels the other if you want to learn more details about the oco orders and using take profit and stop loss with that one take a look at my full tutorial right here where i saw how to use the oco orders on binance then we cancel the orders easily right here and that's it you also notice here that binance there are a couple of different order types that you can use but when you go to buy bit there are like twice more options you can see so many different iceberg 12 scaled order conditional that you cannot even find on binance so spot trading on buy bit they provide you much more options than on binance now let's move into the futures trading where you can of course make money faster but lose money faster as well for example here i earned more than 3400 usdt with one trade now if i would want to set up a take profit or stop loss for this one which is an open position i can simply click this one right here take profit stop loss for position and here i can choose and now i can choose with an pnl roi percentage or offset percentage let me put pnl for example once i have earned ten thousand dollars profits then it would set up the take profit here then a stop loss if i would lose for example 100 dollars then i could put it right this then i can click here confirm you can choose price protection or not i will tap it off and then i click here confirm you can see it's directly right here take profit and stop loss it's set now if you want to adjust it you can simply click this pen icon right here and you can click this cancel immediately now let me put these numbers a little bit closer to the current price for example 110,000, and then also stop loss 100,000. and i click here confirm and i click confirm again and now it's set up right here notice that in this example i set up the price and it calculates the pnl the profit automatically but you can also do it other way around so you can put the specific pnl and then it adjusts automatically the price right here you notice here that if the price would drop into 100,000, my profit of this trade will still be more than three thousand dollars automatically and then of course if you want to use the error i percent that's that's also fine let's say that i want to take the money when i have 500 100 ROI so I have multiplied my money that's right here and then on stop loss for example when I would have lost half of my money BTC would need to drop into less than 50k so things are looking extremely good right here let me cancel these ones to keep the positions open still for a longer time I click here confirm now this one is trading with the USDT but let's move into this uh, USDC trading here and now let's open an example order so if you want to set up take profit and stop losses when your position is already open you do it right here but you can also do it while you are opening your trade you simply come right here and then you notice that on binance futures there are much more order types than for example on spot there is literally anything you can imagine but let's put here market then you scroll this one right here and here is this box take profit stop loss so i tap that one right here and here you can choose basic easy way or you can choose advanced let me show you first the easy way so take profit for example uh, 119,950 stop loss for example 103k a little bit higher than that and then you can click here open long the trade will be opened with these values of take profit and stop loss but you can also click here for advanced and it will give you this pop-up window where you can have more options for your 
rate. Here you can choose stop loss for example when you would have lost 5 USDC and you can choose here PNL when you have made for example a 20 USDC profit it will give you the trigger price automatically. And again if you prefer to do it with the trigger price you can put the number right here and then it calculates the PNL for you. And also the same with ROI for example once you have doubled your money then it automatically calculates for you. Or with the ROI if you lose let's say half of your position it automatically calculates for you the trigger price. Let me click here confirm to show you this example. I click here open long order submitted and now it's available here in the open positions and when I click here TPSL so take profit stop loss it shows me here stop loss and take profit I can cancel them or I can keep them open however I want. Let me also show you how to open the trailing stop orders here you can choose that one and then the callback rate so how much the price needs to move in order for this to execute let's put 5% and the activation price 104k a little bit lower than the current one and then the price right here open long click here confirm and now it goes into open orders and now once the trade will be opened here will be the trigger condition activation price more than 104k the idea is that the stop loss and take profit will follow the price movement upwards so if the price goes higher then also to take profit or stop loss goes higher here you are using a percent that's but if you would be trading for example a bybit futures you can choose also the trailing stop according to distance or specific price for example uh, 5000 USDT so if the BTC price goes to 101k stop loss will be at 105k then if BTC would go into 120k stop loss would move into 115k however that is just to give you an idea you typically want to use the percent that's and that is also what you can do here on Binance but you again noticed here that Bybit even in the futures trading they have more options it's a little bit more flexible and if you want to set up the trailing stop loss you can simply click one button right here for the orders meanwhile for Binance things are not always so simple since you have noticed now that trading on Bybit is oftentimes more flexible you have more order types it's easier to put take profit and stop loss you may want to consider taking a closer look at Bybit as well and learning step by step how I made tens of thousands of dollars with this trade thousands of dollars with another trade how I earn money with automated bots 1500 USDT earned with this one let's take a look at some completed bots 5800 USDT earned with this one I have documented the whole process of different trades and all automated trading bots on my playlist earn money on Bybit. Here I saw for example when I open this trade I give you regular updates how I made tens of thousands of dollars with profits. Same also with the bot. I showed you when I put the money, I show you the price range, I give you regular updates, then I show you how I take the profits. And I also reveal my number one recommended way for making money on Bybit. So if you want to learn all of that, simply take one of your fingers right now Click right here in the corner and learn to earn money on Bybit starting immediately.